Tennessee tees up the ball as we get ready for the opening kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. And they push him out right around the 26-yard line. They come out on an empty backfield. of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. And they make the stop at the 38. Four-yard gain, and that'll be a first down. And still, this gunslinger hasn't missed a receiver yet on this drive. They come out in a five-wide set. Pressure on the quarterback forced that incompletion. Boy, they really pounded him on that throw. It's second and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Hey, check Mike 45. Check Mike 45. Tighten up. Tighten up. Pull together. Throws that to the running back. No good. I know this quarterback trusts his arm and his receivers, but he's got to know when not to throw the ball. He didn't have any room at all, and he's lucky it wasn't intercepted. Throws right, intercepted. Great catch by the linebacker, but not a smart throw from the quarterback. It didn't look like the quarterback even saw the linebacker hanging in that area. It pays to be in the right spot at the right time. It's first and ten. Ball on the 17. Excellent play as the quarterback found his receiver for a big game. Well, give credit here to the receiver for finding that seam and coming up with a nice game for the offense. He fires left side, and it's intercepted by the freshman cornerback. It looked like the pass was sailing out of reach, but he just climbed the ladder and made a spectacular interception. These are plays you don't expect a freshman to make, but this kid has the potential to be something really special. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 44-yard line. Got a man. Watch out here. And he's toppled the 40 yard line. So a nice little pitch and catch there, and that'll give the offense a first down. That was a very good-looking pass play to get more than enough yards to move the chains. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Zips it to the tight end. Tackle made at the 10. six-yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. The score now, 7-0. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. 
Their last drive ended with an interception. We're about to find out what the defense can do this time. One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. He gains his way to the 43-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Yard line. Tight end right. Gain five, five yards. yards. Tight end right. That, that brings him second and five. Three down, three down. Mike 13. Mike 13. Kill, three kill, nine, kill. Three, nine. Nine. three. Check. Check. They go with the runner. He's taken down behind the line. Third and five. Ball in the 23. He's scrambling. And now he's going to run. And he's taken down at the 16 yard line. That's a deep seven. That makes it first and ten. Kill, kill. The ten. Touchdown, Vols. Great call by the offensive coordinator. Big time play, taking that ball all the way in. Maybe the defense wasn't expecting a run. The extra point to tie this game up. And he hits the PAT. So an eight play, 74 yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. You know, this offensive line has done a really good job. But really, I think it's more about the big play ability from the running backs and why we've seen so many big plays from this offense. We're even at seven in this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't. Throws it to coverage, just picked off. He's tackled at the 33. Big play there by the defense. That's their second pick of the half. Yeah, this offense has to stop making mistakes. These turnovers are putting pressure on their defense to make stops, and it's hard to win when you're always giving the ball away. First and 10, ball on the 33-yard line. And he's hit immediately. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. He's on the run. He makes his way out to about the six. On the draw, tackled in the backfield. You know, these backwards plays can have a psychological impact. It can damage a team's confidence if it keeps happening. From the eight-yard line. Second down. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Fires quickly, and they got it. Touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. And he converts the extra point. A 
a four play 33 yard drive and that's good for a touchdown. So our score 14 7 and it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Tennessee's looking awfully impressive right now in defense, but we are in the first quarter. Yeah, this is about a dominant first quarter that we have seen in a long time. But let's see if they can continue to play this well throughout the rest of the ball game. The offense will take the field, hoping for a better result than their last drive. He's got a lot of time to forget about that last pick. He's just got to stick to the game plan. Passes left, gets it out to the halfback. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Brought down around the 39 yard line. Gets it. He's in space. He's out of bounds at about the 47 yard line. Well, that's the beauty of running play action against zone coverage. In man, the defender has his eyes on the guy's covering. But in zone, the defender's looking right at the quarterback. That's why that play action works so well for a first down. They weren't sure if it was a run or a pass. Completion and we'll have a first and ten coming up. Good look there from the quarterback dumping it off and coming away with a new set of downs. And the quarterback didn't waste any time getting rid of that one. He took the snap and he threw it right out there. Gets it out quickly. And he's taken down at the 25. That's a deep, 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 deep. That brings Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Great tackle at the 21-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. Coming to you, coming to you. Check, check, Disco Raver. Disco Raver. Catches it, and he's looking for more. And he's level at the 11-yard line. This offense has really stalled on their last two trips to the red zone. for getting in sync, really fighting to create that touchdown. They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. He makes the PAT. A 10-play, 75-yard drive, and they put up seven points. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. 14 apiece. He sends this one deep. Washington State gets set to kick this one away. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Every drive's important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. And he just gets rid of it. Great job by the defense at getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 25. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. He gets hit out of bounds at the 34. That'll make it 31. So at the end of one quarter, we're deadlocked right now at 14. Welcome back to the action. Just about set to start quarter number two, and we're all tied up. Hey, hey. So Mike, Mike 51, Mike 51. Red, two. Big opening. Makes it to the 44. That's good for a game of 10 yards. Hey, hey, let's go, let's go, let's go. Kill, kill, 
kill, kill! Gunner Check three! Seven, red, seven. Motion, motion, motion! Quick throw out to the receiver. That's a game of three on the play. That makes it second and six. He's immediately tackled. Game of 12 on the play. I got you. That I makes it first and 10. ten. sure he's going to hear all that about that from his teammates when he comes over to the sidelines. So it's fourth down. They're going to try a long field goal here. Tennessee could take the lead with this field goal. It's up, looks long enough, and he splits the uprights. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Quick strike to the receiver. And down he goes, around the 40-yard line. receiving with that grass. Now, if you were to ask this defense, who wants to cover this guy? I bet you nobody's going to raise their hand because this receiver is embarrassing them. Keep in mind, we're still in the second quarter, and this kid is putting up these numbers. And they got it. Brad, not only did they give up a sack here, but their quarterback just got hit and hit hard. If I'm an offensive coordinator, especially an offensive line coach, I'm getting a hold of my offensive line, making sure these guys are on the same page, and they've got to take more pride in taking care of their quarterback than that play right there. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Dumps it complete over the middle. And they make the stop at the 46-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Quick throw. He's hit and taken down. Caught open field, and he's tackled at the 27. Call it a gain of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Five wide. 34, eyes on 34. 45 is the mark. Quick throw, and he's got the tight end again. And he's pushed out of bounds, setting up a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. He's wrapped up 
for the sack. That brings up second and goal. This is the ninth play of this drive. Offensive line and the receivers made a concerted effort to get into the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Now, this has been a great game to watch. A lot of competitive spirit out there. The offenses seem to be going up and down the field. Back and forth we go. I think the winner will be which defense can make that pivotal stop to secure a victory. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. And off, and he's met immediately. This is the time to open up your playbook and do something unpredictable. So I'm not sure what they're trying to accomplish right here. Green eye, green eye. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. From their own 25-yard line, third down. Halfback's got it on a quick throw. Tackle made at the 28-yard line. Looks like the defense was in man coverage there, fellas, and that's why they stopped that screen. Yeah, and when the secondary isn't dropping back into zone, it makes it difficult to have success with that kind of screen play. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. And he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack a defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have done an outstanding job in being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks, and the quarterback put the ball right on the mark. From their own 37-yard line, second down. Washington State holds a four-point lead. Tennessee is going to have to use their second time out of the half. They'll be short of the first down after that unsuccessful running play. Nice job here by the defense of holding firm and forcing a fourth down. He really got a hold of that one. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Fires it out. Tackle at the 28. Reception. Number 51 on the tackle at the 28-yard line. That makes it second and two. Mike 51, Mike 51. Jump, check! Yellow three. Yellow three. Go. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. That makes it first and ten.
from their own 48-yard line. First down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. He's tackled for the 38-yard line. Kill, kill. That's good for you. Man for two. First down. They come out on an empty backfield. He's taken down at the 24-yard line. Hey, kill, kill, kill! Where? First down. Black five, black five! Kill, kill, kill! Gunner three! They'll make the sack. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. They found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. Kicks away, and he nails the long field goal. Great game in the works, folks, as we come to the end of the first half. The Cougars lead it by one. All right, Reese, David, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. Sends it sailing downfield. And they can forget about returning this one. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Number 13 brings him down at the 30-yard line. That brings him second and five. 51, Mike. Mike 51. Easy. Nice run there as they work the outside. That's a gain of six on the play. That makes it first and ten. Two down, two down. Mike 51. Mike 51. Makes it out to about the 50. He makes his way to about the 38. He's going to try and scramble. He'll take it himself. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. So the sack makes this a second and long. Good tackle there in space. Makes 
six yards. Here we go, D. That'll make Here it second and four. Again. Here I come again. Here I come again. Mike 51. Mike 51. <laughs> and he's taken down at the one. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it first and goal. Mike 51. Mike 51. Hey, kill, kill, kill! Black five, black five! Go. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. So he decides to hold on to it, and it goes nowhere. With the defensive line neutralizing the blocks, these linebackers are able to come up and make plays in the holes. Scrambling around. Decides to take it himself, and he's got it. Touchdown. He got the defense on their heels, and he just waltzed in for the touchdown. Brad, great job of improvising by the quarterback there, showing pass, breaking down the defense, and then going in for the touchdown. Well, they're going to try for the two-point conversion. Tennessee lines up for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Both these offenses stepping up and answering the bell. Who's going to blink first here? <laughs> exactly right. I've just been impressed with the way they've been able to execute. I mean, there's, there's a lot of pressure on them. Anytime you're feeling that the other offense can put points up on the board, there's a tendency to want to press. Either one, either one has done that up to this point, and right now it's going to come down to who can continue to execute put points up. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. And he just gets rid of it. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Throws incomplete. We've got third and ten. Ball on their own 25. Finds his man. First down. They'll bring him down at the 38. throw by the quarterback, but to be fair, that was pretty good coverage. Third down, and they need to get it to the 19. Hey, let's get them holes. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Taken back three yards. Pretty good stand there. They weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call. Fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. Down, 
It has the distance, and he just drilled it from long range. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. The Volunteers have got to remember that they've still got a fight on their hands in this football game. Yeah, they cannot afford to get sloppy. Remember the first half, how bad they looked. And as good as things are going right now, with an entire quarter to go, they got to continue to play good football. They ran the ball very well on their last drive, and it resulted in six. Tennessee holds just a two-point lead. And they hit him in the backfield. You're not going to see this very often from this running back. He just got gobbled up pretty deep in the backfield. Second down at 14. Ball on their own 21. He unloads it. And that one's incomplete. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. He gets hit out of bounds at the 41 yard line. That's good for a game of 20 yards. First down. Give to the tailback, and he's met in the backfield. From their own 39 yard line, it's second down. Nice run up the middle. Intercepted. Boy, Brad, this guy drops an interception. And what's ironic about that from going for the meetings the other day is that this guy's been telling the coaches he wants to play some wide receiver. You wonder why you're not playing wide receiver? Because you can't catch the ball as a defensive back. And this one is a beauty. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. It's it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he's tackled at the 26-yard line. Him out at the 42. Three yard loss there. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. From their own 42 yard line. Second down. You can't block me. You can't block me. Tackle made right around the 42 yard line. complete he's got room to work he's pushed out of bounds right around the 22 yard line Six. 
And he's hit immediately. That's three down and one to go. Tennessee's leading by two. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. And out left to the running back. Tackle at the six yard line. That's a good one. Three yards. That brings up second goal. He has some room. Touchdown, and they take the lead. Goal for two in this situation. Washington State is up four. And it's caught for two. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. He goes out of bounds at the 29-yard line. because this defense had so much penetration into the backfield. We would have been lucky to get back to the line of scrimmage. Pretty obvious passing down here as they're faced with third and long. And they'll bring it down behind the line. So a running play on third and long, that's been very little yardage. Now you can't do that when you're losing a ball game. Now's the time to take your shots downfield. Excellent point. He makes it out to maybe the 39-yard line. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Catches it, and he's looking for more. Inside the 30. Loose football. And scooped up. You love to see your playmakers on defense coming through and creating some breaks, which is exactly what the safety did. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Taken down at the 30-yard line. The grab. That's a game of 12 on the play. That makes it first and 10. It's complete. He's tackled at the 43-yard line. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. He's scrambling. Brought down at the 42-yard line. Gains his way to the 33-yard line. That's a deep That brings up second and one. Kill, kill, kill! 
Six, three. Seven. Motion, motion. <laughs> Throws complete. He's got space to work. And he's taken down around the 27 yard line. That makes it first and 10. Just under three to go in regulation. And he's going to be sacked. And this play is number eight on the drive. Green two, orange three, orange three. And he is drilled at the 41. Fourth and long here after the sack. Let's go, hurry up, on the ball, on the ball. And they could really put their opponent in bad field position with a good punt here. Out of bounds at the 20-yard line. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. He's to the 40. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. I think the defense is starting to be concerned about the outcome of this game. That was a huge first down by the offense. And at this point, you wonder if the defense will make a play to get their own offense back out on the field. Takes the ball inside. Makes it to the 37. I think the defense put everything into that sequence of plays. And for the offense to come up with a first down really is demoralizing for the defense. Just under two to go in the game. Makes it out to about the 26. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 26-yard line. In the shotgun and five wideouts. it out to about the 16. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. And he'll just take a knee here to kill the clock. Washington State, 32, Tennessee, 26. The Volunteers, 26. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreet, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.